Now, Dennis Daly presents another in his new series of Nightcast Broadcasts. Hi, and thanks again, everybody. It was 70 years ago today that one of the ugliest incidents that ever happened on a college football field took place. During a game between Drake and Oklahoma State at State University in Stillwater, a member of the Oklahoma team violently punched quarterback Johnny Bright, a rising young black player from Drake in Des Moines. The entire sequence was captured by a cameraman from an Omaha newspaper. He would later win a Pulitzer Prize. After the start of play, Oklahoma State University player Will Banks Smith moved toward Bright and clobbered him, breaking his jaw. Before the game, it became no secret that Oklahoma State was out to get Bright. Even the college newspaper had published articles saying Bright was, quote, a marked man. The shouts of fans in the stadium that day were downright dangerous and racist. Those photographs taken by the Des Moines reporter eventually made their way into Life magazine. Meanwhile, facing an avalanche of national condemnation, the president of Oklahoma State University denied the incident ever happened. For decades, the Oklahoma school had a rule that you just didn't talk about it. It was only in 2005 that the then president of Oklahoma State wrote a letter to Drake's modern-day president and apologized. Unfortunately, that apology came after Johnny Bright had died. By the way, the guy who threw the punch, Will Bank Smith, was never reprimanded and continued to play. That's Nightcast. I'm Dennis Daly. Listen for Nightcast with Dennis Daly, Monday through Friday evenings at this time. This is the Shrevikman Radio Network. Shrevikman programs are distributed by Ursat Satellite.